So hello everyone and I want to start with today with a quote from Hugo. Man's wisdom help for kids. One you open numbers, one you open letters, and one you open notes. The fantasy of knowledge and thought in it. In it. Today's topic is change. For me, I want to talk about the change in ways people receive information. Before the new media apps come out, if people want to know some later content, what they will do? Maybe read some newspapers, read books and magazines, which they spend a long time on read. But the new era comes up. TikTok and quite show to short apps comes out. New media industries have risen. In 2016, I want to call it the promo period of Douyin. It has polishing its own products and like take a step forward. And in 2017, it has accumulated a huge amount of user space and improved its diversification. After 2017, it's a growth period of Douyin. It even opened overseas markets. So with the normal content and blessing of celebrities, we can see many superstars join TikTok and upload some short videos, right? Though it has been quickly used across the whole country. So what does this bring? Public attention. More and more activities are carried out on Douyin. For example, last year, Douyin Club are recruited for new people join and to a further improvement, the rise of live streamings and many big events going can be seen. What is the data looks like? In 2021, the data shows that Douyin and Kwai show to short video apps had occupied most of young people's daily life. They will open it while they are waiting for others, while they have nothing to deal with, and while they are waiting for cars even. So, before they realize that, time are gone. So, they are also being named as the time killer. So, what is a po key point? People spend a long time on watching short videos. Let's talk about the advantages and disadvantages of it. TikTok's Pro, maybe it's the diversification of information. People can check many information in a short time, but the information is so fragmented and it's hard to link them together. The previous video and the next video, what I want to say is both had run. Like, there even appears some flagrism phenomenon, like people can check three or even more the same videos, they didn't even change a manuscript. People will be so busy on it. The dance, so maybe several hours later, everything will be forgotten. And the downside of reading, what I want to mention is that maybe it costs a lot of time, like if I want to finish a book, I will spend three months, even more, to complete a whole story. But I can have a clearly structure in my mind. And I can remember key stories, key timelines for some days some month or even some years. So, with the advanced technology, our daily life is changing every day. Like, we can call in taxes, we can order in takeaways, in several rules, even minutes or seconds on our mobile phones. What about the future? The future is unpredictable, and we cannot change that. And also, we can shopping online without leaving our bed. So, what I want to say is that no matter how time's changing, how life's changing, hope we can all achieve something in the great river of times. That's all about my sharing. Thank you all.